Today I'm going to show you how to print an iPhone 5 case on your Zortrax M200. So uh, that's the print finished. Let's um, remove it from the bed. Just you want to use the scraper that comes in the toolkit for this. And you want to let the plate cool down as much as possible. And that should mean that it should come off quite easily. It's nice to take your time with this. Don't rush it. Just ensure that you don't damage the print when removing. As you can see, it sticks it down really well, which is perfect for 3D printing. There you go. Okay, so here's our finished iPhone case. And as you can see, uh, it's still got the raft attached. Uh, we'll just remove that now. It's quite easy. It just peels off like this. And again, I'm going to be quite careful doing this. Uh, is sometimes some of the raft can remain on the print. If you do it systematically, it should all come off in one go. And there you go, there are the two parts, and we can just get rid of that. There's the case, and if you want to look at the, the back edge, you can just see it does leave a slight texture. But at 190 microns that this print was done at, it's turned out really, really well. And so the next thing to test is whether it fits. So here's our phone. Uh, we'll just slot that in there. It's a nice snug fit. Okay, look at that, pretty good. And it's got all the, all the right holes so you can still access your, your volume buttons. Thanks for watching. If you like the video, then please click to subscribe. For more information on the printers and materials we've used in this video, visit dream3d.co.uk.